Hey, what's up guys? My name is Silent Core, and today I'm going to be talking about Red Dead Redemption 2 and what we know so far about this game. So just before I get into this video, I want to address this first because I know I'm going to get comments about it. So this will actually be the third game in the Red Dead series. There was actually one before Red Dead Redemption called Red Dead Revolver. Uh, I believe that was released in 2004, if anyone actually played that one. <laughs> However, it is still possible that this game could be called Red Dead Redemption 2. Just like how there's a Black Ops 3, but it's the 12th game in the Call of Duty series, um, it could just use a subtitle for Red Dead Redemption, or it could be something completely different. We just really don't know what the title could be, it's just speculation at this point. So first of all, I want to take you guys back to a Rockstar statement way back in 2012. This was one Rockstar made on their official newswire, it was kind of like a Q&A session. And somebody asked, all I want to know, is there going to be a new Red Dead Redemption game anytime soon? Will there be a sequel or a prequel to Red Dead Redemption? And they replied and said they're thrilled so many people enjoyed John Marston's tale and are excited for more epic western action. And they went on to say that they don't always rush to make sequels, but that doesn't mean that they won't get to them eventually. Stay tuned for further announcements about the future of the Red Dead series. So it's highly, highly likely we're going to be getting another Red Dead game. It's just a question of when. Red Dead Redemption was released way back in May 2010, so five years later it would kind of make sense for them to release this now. Comparing that back to GTA 4 that was released in 2008, GTA 5 came in 2013, which also had a development time of 5 years since its predecessor. So assuming Red Dead Redemption would share this development cycle, it looks quite likely we'll get some information on this in 2016. So let's look a little bit closer at Rockstar's release schedule. I made a note of every game that's come out in every year, so as you can see 2004 had San Andreas, 2005 Liberty City Stories, 2006 Vice City Stories, Manhunt 2, and uh, do you guys see the theme here? Every single year we had a Rockstar game. And that's since 2002. So since 2002 we've had at least one Rockstar release every single year. So if this trend continues, what could that 2016 game be? Could it be Red Dead Redemption? And just to throw in another little bit of evidence, in 2014 Rockstar San Diego actually posted um, job openings for 37 new positions. And that was a pretty strong hiring spree for um, that studio to be working on. A yet to be announced project, probably for PlayStation 4, Xbox One and PC, so it managed to get some um, attention there in the news articles. So PSU also published this article covering Take-Two's recent announcement of having unannounced games in the works. And if you guys weren't already aware, Take-Two Interactive is essentially the parent company for both Rockstar Games and 2K Games. And the president of Take-Two, Carol Slatoff, announced, Our worldwide development teams are working on numerous unannounced projects including new intellectual properties, so new IPs, and also offerings from our established franchises. So Red Dead is a perfect example of an established franchise. He also confirmed that at least one of the new games will be released in 2016. The thing Carl did not clarify is whether the new title would be from an existing franchise or just a new IP, so um, this could really be anything from Take-Two or a Rockstar game. Um, you know, this could be an, a sports game from 2K, or even, you know, something from Rockstar like Red Dead. And as PSU reports here, there's a lot of different options of what this could be. Um, it's way too early for GTA 6, obviously, but, you know, games like Bully or Max Payne um, or Red Dead, of course, could definitely be a good fit. Now, most recently, in November, we actually had a bunch of news outlets pick up on a rumour from an ex-employee of Rockstar who confirmed that they were working on the game. Well, kind of confirmed. So the guy that was an ex-employee of Rockstar was um, on the Opie and Anthony show. He was a guy called Danny Ross. And I believe he's played on the radio a lot within GTA 5, so you guys have probably heard him. So this all started when Danny Ross did an AMA on Reddit, which is basically where you start a thread on Reddit and allow users to ask you questions and you just kind of answer them on that Reddit thread. And somebody asked, what does Rockstar have on deck? And his response was a little bit cryptic, as you can see. He said, really dot dumbass dot really two. So the takeaway point here being is that, you know, if you take the first letter of each word, RDR2, could that be hinting at Red Dead Redemption 2? There was a lot of coverage on this. There was so many gaming sites kind of picked up this rumour and kind of ran with it that um, Red Dead Redemption 2 was confirmed. Now apparently he did make a comment after all of this blew up saying, nah, I'm just playing, GTA 6 is up next, but they're waiting for more Michael Mann movies to rip off first. So of course this is far from an official confirmation from Rockstar. Uh, I mean hell, this guy could have even been joking around, just trolling us. 
However, it has been confirmed that this was the real Danny Ross. He did verify himself with an image, and he is actually a former employee of Rockstar's. So let me know what you guys think in the comments. Do you think we'll be seeing another Red Dead game in 2016? And we basically know that Red Dead is a permanent franchise for Rockstar. This game sold a ton of units. They're going to be making another game, so it seems pretty likely we'll get some sort of news next year. Don't forget to leave the video a like if you did enjoy, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.